Hey guys, so um, this is week eight, day four, and I mistake my days again. So today is a five mile run. I'm already about two and a half miles in, and yeah, just kind of looking forward to today being a rest day. Uh, and I've got the Blaine Gatha fun run tomorrow. Potentially I could have just skipped today and done the run tomorrow. But I think I would have felt bad not sticking to my program. I've still got a long way to go and I don't want to stuff up the uh, daily schedules just yet. Maybe later in the program, but we'll see how it goes. Hmm. Uh, anyway, that's about it for now. See you soon. Now on the final mile of my run, got about half a mile to go. Uh, speed is being up and down, as you'd expect. Right now I'm running on uh, uh, two beers. <laughs> And what did I have for dinner? I had a gnocchi carbonara with pulled pork. <laughs> so no wonder I had those huge stitches, hey. Anyway, short video. Busy day. Just doing what I can, don't mind the fluff. <laughs> Point four of a mile to go. All right, thanks guys. Thanks for watching. Tomorrow's video will be much better, I promise. Bye, love you all. Okay, one final part for the day. Don't mind the hairy chest or the nippled, or the, not nippled, band-aided, taped up nipples. Uh, so all these years, there's only been one time where I've come close to losing toenails. And that was my first Melbourne Marathon. That was like three, four years ago now. And yeah, going on to four years ago, nearly in a few months. And tonight I didn't even realize that this had happened. So I think this training is definitely pushing me to some new limits, that and the work hours I'm currently doing. Anyway, I'll leave the end of this video with a view of what my feet are looking like now. So tomorrow is definitely a rest day and the rest of the week. Okay, thanks guys, bye. Aren't they just lovely? Especially that one. Thanks guys, bye. Oh, and that's my sock after the run. I didn't feel it during the run. It just, after the run ended, my feet were sore. <laughs>